What's up, guys and girls and fans of art? Remember these sample paints that I got from Vicky Norman? Well, I'm gonna be bringing these on a test drive here at a Thomas Kids workshop. So stick around. Hi guys, we are in Castle Bridge and uh, Tony's studio is right there if you're interested on what it looks like in there and the sessions that he has. Check this clip out. We're right here in the park next to the Castle Bridge Studios at a Thomas Jefferson Kids workshop and I'm, I'm ready to rock and roll. So I'm gonna limit myself to three colors um, and I've gotten these colors, I'm, I'm getting to use them for the very first time. Michael Harding, they were given to me as samples by Vicky Norman. I'm an ambassador for Michael Harding, so I paint all over the world. I'm a plein air artist, give workshops and share the joys of Michael Harding's paint. I do mixing videos on YouTube. You can find me on Vicky Norman on YouTube. So these are the colours. Mid cat yellow kind of and a red and of course ultramarine and plus white. And we're gonna try to get that scene over there. Just, let's make this happen guys. Michael Harding oil paints are top of the line. They are the Ferrari of all oil paints. All of them are handmade, going through a painstaking process using techniques dating back to the old masters. They cost a bit more, but you know what? You get what you pay for. Uncompromising quality, high pigment content, rich, vibrant, and durable. This really feels like I'm painting with butter. So it's bright and sunny right now, but in about 30 minutes, it might drizzle. So we're all gonna head over to Tony's studio now. That's the Castle Bridge studio. See you in a bit. time guys have fun of good learning points today um, here at Castle Bridge Studios. Thank you so much for You're sitting! So Yay! Initially I had posted this but I think I got a comment from someone saying that it's not a review, it's more like an ad. Sorry about that. Uh, probably stems from my advertising background. So here I am giving some sort of a review to the colours that I'm using right now, rather the pigments that I'm using right now. Uh, they uh, first of all, the word butter just comes to mind, how, how smooth and creamy it is. And also knowing that it's not just butter with air fillers in there, but butter with really good, solid, vibrant pigments in there. So when I mix, I get really brilliant colours with all that intensity that's happening in there. So with the gradation that we see here in the grass, there's also the darker grass patches and the lighter ones so all I'm doing is just adding that ultramarine to the limey green patches of grass that I have here and if I want that I can mute that down. Um, also creating a some sort of a sandy area using the yellow and the red that I have mixing to a rough orangey thing but adding uh, uh, some white to make it more muted so that it looks like this sandy sort of color that we need for this scene. I'm also using a lot of white and just a little bit of this ultramarine blue to create the sky and the gradient between that. So in a gist I'm able to mix up all the colors that I need 
with these three colors ultramarine blue yellow lake and scarlet lake from from Michael Harding and of course including a white and um, I may take this out I may continue practicing using these three colors because um, the fewer colors you use on a palette technically the more unified your drawing or your painting would be once again it does cost a lot more than regular paints but hey you really get what you pay for first and foremost it's a thumbs up from me Michael Harding is definitely the bomb so there you have it folks this end bit this extra bit that I've added to this video and uh, thanks again for your feedback this is Elvin Mark trying to get my videos to a more meaningful experience for you guys out there until the next one guys ciao